the New Balance Indoor Grand Prix will be held on the 4th of February as part of the World Athletics Indoor Tour Series. We are guaranteed to witness several top-class sprinters and world champions at the meet, such as Grant Holloway, Noah Lyles, Jake Whiteman and Trevon Bromel. In the women's sprints, we will get to see the return of double Olympic medalist Gabby Thomas in the women's 300m race. Thomas, the winner of the bronze medal in the 200m and silver in the 4x100m relay at the Tokyo Olympics, had mixed results last year. The American athlete started 2022 with some great performances in the 200, but her season was disrupted by a hamstring injury. She failed to make the US team for the World Championships in Eugene as she failed to make the podium at the US Nationals in her pet event. Her biggest win last year was at the Doha Diamond League, where she ran her season's best time of 21.98 seconds to beat Sherika Jackson. Thomas had some good indoor results in her career. The NCAA Indoor Championship title over 200 meters for Harvard University in 2018 is her biggest indoor performance to date. Thomas will be aiming for her fifth straight win at the New Balance Indoor Grand Prix. She won the women's 300 meter event in 36.21 seconds last year, which was the third fastest time in the world for the event. She has a personal best of 35.73 seconds for indoor 300 meters, which is the fifth fastest time of all time. She is only 200th of a second short of Kenara Hayes' US record. What do you think about Gabby's chances of breaking the US record at the New Balance Grand Prix? Make sure to comment and please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more track and field content.